Welcome back to the Super Squad Podcast. My name is Chris. Cody. And I am Nick. Hello. Why are we wearing the same shirts? For three weeks. I haven't done laundry. That's fair. <laughs> to be fair, it's a good shirt. You're a dirty boy. Hey, I know. You guys go to cbsquarepodcast.beer to buy shirts. Yeah, you want a gold one? You can get a gold one. I have a random Voltron Limited shirt. edition. <laughs> I have a Voltron shirt from Blue Crate that I don't even think they make anymore. <laughs> you gotta fix the mic and so you can talk into it. Stupid. I am. So, into Cody, what, what I were, feel like I'm loud enough. Oh, you're loud enough. Yeah. So what are uh, Freddy's? Freddy's. 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 We are. I'm finding it right now. So I'm finding it right now. We started playing Freddy's again. It's bi-weekly. We it's bi-weekly. Yes. I hope you guys are okay with that. Um, I I would think if if we might do one, two unlocks every two weeks. Make it fair. What? Huh? What you say? Unlocks every two. Yeah, weeks. Yeah, maybe two unlocks. You know. We'll get to. So we're basically, gonna, instead of if you guys watch this but you don't watch friendies that's weird based on the numbers but let's let's hypothetically say you don't hey but so, they, there might be people that are only here for the podcast actually there i know there are some people here that are only for the podcast no that is true so two i think i think there's like 20 so so we're gonna do friendies back again every two weeks uh we're gonna get two items instead of one though is the difference big item guys big item guys we're big video game boys now we are video game boys check out our game plays um so I will give immediately. I'm a big fan of Buckshot Roulette. Buckshot the guest star you guys had. Buckshot good. Roulette is good. I think we're gonna try and play Buckshot Roulette again. We are gonna play Buckshot Roulette again. Uh, double or I'm nothing. Gonna, I'm gonna give a core. I, th- I think I don't think it's double or nothing. I think it's like one life. No, no it's hardcore nothing. mode. Oh, is it hardcore? Double or nothing. Let's do it. So I'm gonna give immediately shout outs to Set Rot Rot 2100. You know who you are. Uh, Kobe Kobe Bryan 69. Draconic wealth, of course. Of course. And uh, I'll, you know what, case on 2272. Shout out to YouTube, bro. So we had a lot of questions during the video of what the fuck happened, X, Y, Z. We yeah, had no idea. They reset all of our progress. They did some updates. There's some skins missing. I think some skins are renamed. It's a whole lot of questions, and honestly... Apparently, no skins were renamed. Apparently... It's either you still have it from the previous, or it's just completely gone and fresh. Oh. So apparently nothing has been renamed. Oh, shit. Okay. So uh, as far as what stayed was like all core material that he did not get from others, or it's gone. Like there's no real and in between. Gone. Like I don't, I, from what I understand from the whole controversy, nothing was renamed. So apparently there was a drama in the community regarding proper credit of artists. Someone made a long ass video that heavily criticized them, blah, blah, which blah. I haven't found. I'm trying to find it. Okay, yes, I will ask this question to you too, Draconic. In our gameplay, and here, if you watch this, I would love the link to that video because I could not find it either. So if you could find it, which he says was quite unfair at some points, which is totally fair. Um, I don't know the full scope, but in the end, a lot of changes were made to the game. The dust hasn't settled on the matter, and it seems like it has been resolved amicably, which is nice. Uh, but some people may be sensitive. So yada, yada, yada. Essentially, the controversy about inclusion of skins without the permission of skin creators. This is from Seth Cross. Um, even though the devs bought them. So apparently what happened was, the word on the street, is these skins were purchased. Yes. But they did not buy, I guess, full rights to them. So thus, they still had obligation of where they wanted it. And they did not necessarily allow them to be used, and they were still being used. Yeah, I don't know how that whole situation would work because I would assume if you buy the skin, you have rights to the skin to use it however you want. You would think, but I think I think you know maybe they just said they probably just went something like this: "Hey, that's a cool skin. Can I buy it?" And then the guy selling the skin was like, "Sure," and then bought it, and then didn't like write up a contract or anything. Yeah. And been like, hey, I know you bought the skin, but you didn't say that this was going to be used for, you know. To make money. A commercial commercial use. Yeah. To make money. Because it is commercial profit use. profit off of it. Which yeah. is why Because if it was, they probably would have sold that skin for. More I money. I would assume. I don't know how much they still. Uh, let's just say they sold the skin for 200 bucks. Hypothetically. They're going to make way more than $200 on that game. They've made way more than $200 probably in the last three days. Yeah. Which is why, kids out there, you always try to sell on percentages. 100%. You want future profits. Or buy equity. I was going to say buy equity. I've yeah. Seen, I've seen Shark. shark yeah, team. so that whichever sell you do, you get equity off of it, and then you just – that's 
infinite money glitch right there. You just go bam, 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 bam. So passive yeah. income. Dude, even if you do a 2% equity on something like a game like that, that's like passive money right there. Yeah, so, yeah so like what Chris said, I'm assuming people were like, hey, you want to buy that? Sure. What do you want? 500 bucks. Okay, we'll buy it. Throws it in the game. That's a new unlock. People go crazy for new unlocks. More people are subbing, and then they see, wow, you have all these subscribers paying, all, or all these Patreons paying all this money. Where's my more money? And then it goes to hell. Yeah. Which is why also, kids, get everything this, in writing. That's just, this is just hypothetical. We don't know if this happened. We're just thinking maybe this happened. Maybe it's a whole different thing. Maybe they just... Didn't even buy the skins. Maybe they just said, "Here's a slick twenty, and I'm gonna use this skin." Who knows? I don't know yeah, what I happened. It was it's just, I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> just hypothetical. Yeah, but also a, a big thing is apparently they're just not. I'm still enjoying the game. First of all, I think it's a very, very fun game. Yeah, me too. You don't even watch the videos, you nope. fucker. <laughs> <laughs> nope. I remember he's like, "Well, I'll watch the videos when we get a thousand. Fuck yourself. No, you don't. I watch the videos that I'm in. If I'm being honest. That's what most people on the podcast say. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Lucas, Justin, Tommy, Alberto, Gunther. They'll be like, I watch what I'm in. Yeah. I'm like fake fan. Yeah, I watch I watch everything to like make sure everything is well, actually. I also done just correctly. watch other YouTubers and it's hard to shuffle you guys in with better YouTubers. Oh, That's, wow. fair. That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. I agree with you. I agree with you hundred percent. But we're trying. Put it in the background. I, I put the podcast in the background sometimes. So anyways. Um is what what else? Oh yeah, so I was gonna say so I'm still enjoying it. It's just what I was thinking recently. Mm -hmm. And hear me out. I hope this doesn't go to a, another game that we have fond memories of that had the world in its hands oh. and let it slip through its fingers. I'll check. The, I'll check that Discord. So we were just concerned that Monster Girl Island was a game that we loved, and I'm very concerned that this might slip into the abyss that Obscurity. that did. Become the next Monster Girl Island where the devs don't just do abandon the game. Yeah, yeah the community basically ruined it. It wasn't the community, it's the dev. Yeah. Well, for Monster Girl, for Monster Monster Girl, Girl Island. Island. The not... dev doesn't do anything and he, she said, fuck it, I'm going to make a, uh, what is it, a story yeah. book game. It's, I don't know. It's like, oh, it's a dating sim. He's going to make a dating, it's not going to be a three third person adventure game anymore. It's not going to have any effort. No. But it's like, damn. We, you had everything, and we had such good times with you, and now we won't. And that's you know, that's really the world, isn't it? Yeah. You suck. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, apparently it took them three months. They finally put out an update, and uh, that update it, removed a bunch of shit. The update removed a bunch of shit. Didn't fix Chris's glitch. She so Chris is still upset. Yeah, you still infinitely sprint. I mean, I love the game. It's a good game, and <clears throat> honestly, I mean, I love. The devs, I think, are cool. I've never seen them. Never mind them. But they comment on our videos, and they like our videos. So they got to so like... By, therefore, they're cool. So they got to like us a little bit. But they, I mean... Well, yeah, you're giving them they're good. advertisement. They're, they're relatively decent at giving updates. They have a daily update channel that they don't really daily update. It's like every other day. But I know like before... Before, it used to be like every day. Now it's like maybe once a week. Maybe. And they do... Here's the thing. I, I think um, being listening to your community is very good, but you have to kind of know where to go based off of that. You can't just follow the community because I think the commu most time the communities don't know what they want. Nick. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought it was most, most of the I just slowly turned and looked at the camera. <laughs> so here's here's one of the main issues that I do have with the, the community. The community. The community. They have – so they have they have polls. Uh, that are only for Patreon members, which I actually can't find anymore. Okay, I have it. Well, we're a Patreon member. We have yeah, a vote. Polls. Yeah, so we have a vote. But so he, the last vote they had was, uh, what do you want us to work on next? Story, oh, I Story Night 3, uh, Christmas Special 3, or a mysterious third option? Mystery third option. Everyone went for mystery third option. Of course. Instead of the story. Well, it's a mystery. To be fair, they could also be story. You don't know. To be fair, to be fair. I would have voted for mystery. <laughs> I voted for story. It's the allure. Okay, maybe I guess I'm in the wrong here. No, yeah. no one's saying you're in the wrong here. I just think it's very. Well, you guys just agreed, opposite of me. So, but but to be fair, that's I'm pretty sure this is a Family Guy bit. Oh, is it's it? like you could get your tax refunds, or you could have whatever's in this mystery box. <laughs> yeah, and it like, could be a yacht. <laughs> oh yeah, it could be a yacht. It's not. It's a box. Oh it's yeah, thirty six cents. So I don't think anybody is wrong. 
I just think that that is a big issue where you don't have a lot of people working on something and you have 3,000 people all demanding different things. Oh, yeah. Because then it's like, okay, so what? Do I go with you? Then is your vote more important than this person's vote? But if I go with you, then you're going to cry because now you think that person's more important than that person's vote. So it's just one of those things where it's like, fuck it, put a poll up, like fucking whoever wins, wins. Yeah, we don't have that problem because only 10 people ever use the polls. Yeah, so <laughs> that's not true. With one of them got like 300, 300 votes. Yeah, there's, there's, towards the end, I got to start bringing I'm going to bring them back. There was hundreds of votes at the end. Yeah. But I'm uh, <clears throat> voting our polls that are coming back now. Buy our merch at cbsquarepodcast.beer. Wow, seamless plug. Yes, sir. <laughs> Subscribe. God, I'm so, God, I'm so good. <laughs> I can tell why you're professional. Yes, sir. Oh, wow, you like the taste of I got, I got from? the fake merch on and the real merch on. Cold. Oh, Limited edition that was another thing. Available. They have a suggestion poll. So every once in a while, I ask for a censored version for, for content creators because mm-hmm. it would make making videos easier and quicker. Mm-hmm. Um, and, you know, every most of the time, most of the people like that idea. They think, oh, that's... Good idea. Yeah. So recently I did another suggestion like, have you guys thought about, you know, selling merch? Because I would buy a shirt that says Fab Nights of Frenny's on it. Just a little, little yeah. thing right here. Like just do the like just do the uh little the, logo. The no like no, they have their fucking thing like the worker shirt because they have the pizza guy shirts with the thing. Don't yeah. They? Yeah, just sell those. That's what I, and I said, I'm like, you can go to Teespring, which is what we use. You could set up your own design, super easy, you just get the profit. And, like, three people were like, you can't make shirts. You got to ask the devs. And then, then you got to get you got to get approval from the from the people who make the skins. And I'm like, this is a suggestion pool for them to make merch. <laughs> Why are you talking about me making merch? What the fuck are you talking about? It clearly says. I don't make shit. It <laughs> I clearly says, have you guys ever thought about selling merch? You should try Teespring. And then I said, it does this, this, and you just get profit. And they go, oh, you can't. You can't make merch. Like the fu- fuck you! Did now you, I'm gonna make merch. Did you respond to them? No, no, I just fucking left them. Got it. Left them on red. Yeah, yeah, dude, that's crazy. People don't read though. That is very, very true. People do not read. They're like, I saw what I swear I saw, and I hey, swear I go. see it. He they goes, saw me Dragon Ball. He goes, fans. if you want to Wait, sell, read yours first. Read I yours go, first. I go. Have you guys ever thought about selling merch? You can make a quick and easy search using Teespring. They do all the printing, shipping, so it's pretty stress free. So then. This other guy goes, if you want to sell some type of merchandise related to the game, first you should have written permission from the game creators. Not sure about personal use, though. The fuck are you talking about? I literally said, have you guys thought about selling merch? I don't know. Must be a Dragon Ball Z fan. I don't know. Why? His name's don't read. His name's Why? Alpha. I don't know. It's so just have, a meme. have fun with that, Alpha. I know you no, won't watch not this. Not Alpha. Dude, shout what out to Alpha. What about Omega? I don't know. <gasps> He's definitely above him, though. Goku's both. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I am the Alpha and the Omega. What about Remember Ultra? that? It's one of the movies. Yeah. I don't remember what movie it was from, but yes, I think I it was do. a cooler one, wasn't he? There's a lot of when cool he, movies. When he goes Super Saiyan for, like, the first time. Oh, it might have been from the cooler movie. That's the best Dragon Ball movie still. So do we have any more drama that we could talk about? I don't think so. I love drama. All I know is what that... What do you guys we- like about Sly Cooper? <laughs> oh. I'm excited to play. You're not gonna play. I know. You, I mean, I you, meant, can, you can. I meant the collective. If you want, but I mean, it doesn't matter. No, you're pro. You say you're a pro all the time. I am a speed runner. I'm waiting for us to play Castlevania: Curse of Darkness. <laughs> yeah. Is that the one that I, we played? I have no. it downloaded. That's the one we played, right? Yeah. Forever yeah. ago. That's a great game. When we were young lads, I loaded up the first mission. And I said, "Oh, this game's gonna be hard." What Castlevania? Yeah. Yeah. It's Dude. not a very hold your hands game. They kind of just Let's throw castle, you. It's they throw you in there and go, "Hey, figure it out, shithead." And you're like, "Where do I go?" That's how most old. Well, games I'm gonna hatch are. these eggs. Yeah, I like old games for that reason. They respect your intelligence. Now it's like you have to go this way, and you try to go the wrong way. And they're like, "Sorry, that's not where the mission is. Go this way." It's like, "Fuck you." You have to go down this long hallway. You can't check any of the doors because they're all locked. So just keep going forward. Yeah. Fuck you. I'm gonna check every door. Yeah. Even but Castlevania though- is smart in that it's like. It's it's like it misdirects you because a lot of the hallways are kind of just one way hallways, but they make it seem like you're exploring. Oh, I see. It's a smart game oh. like that. Big smart game over there, yeah. dude. Big smart podcast. Yeah, talking about game development, dude, and game, drama. Shout out to game development, dude. Shout out to drama. I love, miss it. I love reading drama. You miss drama. I love reading about. I drama. miss. 
I miss me- I hate reading. being involved in drama. Cody goes, I love causing drama. I love causing drama. I kind of miss being a part of drama. It's always fun. It's a little spice up your day. Like, oh my god, what am I going to do today? <laughs> what can I say to piss someone off and piss ruin their off? day? Yeah, dude. You guys should start selling merch. <laughs> We're going to start selling your merch. <laughs> Let's do it. I'm just kidding. Don't do that. Yeah, sure you ask permission. They would tell us no. Bro, they, they're fucking having issues paying people for skins. They're not going to take our <laughs> Yeah, what the fuck? They're not going to let us fucking <laughs> make they shirts. They wouldn't take free money? No. I assume they get some form of kickback for permission. Oh, maybe. Yeah. Which reminds us, we still have to think of something to be put in the game. So we should fucking figure that. Let's figure that out right now. It's one gonna- the- <laughs> Chris, one of the skins they removed. <laughs> <laughs> what are the skins they removed? We'll just, re- podcast. just tell them to recolor it. <laughs> Hashtag bring back chemical leak Fexa. <laughs> well, that was the that was the one that was black and green, right? We never saw I it. I don't know. Oh, okay. I think I'm chemical sure go- leak was like the hellhound from fucking I'm sure we Hell could of a look- boss. Or I'm something. sure we could look up fucking images of it. Oh yeah. Probably. Or we could just load up the old game and just unlock it. Because I have the old games. I have all the old the old all files. the old updates. Yeah. There I keep go. them all. That way I could go back and look Smart at man. Things. Also, if you're watching this, your casual suit and your elegant suit are fucked up. Yeah, so we bought the elegant suit. It's just some guy in a flannel. And then we checked. It gave us the casual suit. Yeah. So we think that they fucked up and they put the casual suit with the elegant and the elegant with the casual. Or we'll just buy the casual next time and they're both casual and we don't get anything that we want. <laughs> That's also an option. Oh, I think they made an update to where that you could see what skins you buy, at least for the girls. Oh. You can see the skins before you buy it, which I think kind of kills the mystery. We're not going like, to check ahead. I wonder how this skin looks. Yeah, exactly. Is it going to be a reward or am I going to be annoyed because it covers up more skin? They have a skin. They have a skin that's no texture, which I think is actually going to be fucking cool as hell. Yeah, I think that sounds cool. But at the like end of this, the, if you like watch pink and black squares, I was. It mean? was either that or like the PNG like cutout where it's like the white and gray squares. I don't oh, know. I haven't yeah. unlocked it. So yeah. I, and if you do want to see that or whatever you want to see, drop it in the comments. Uh, we're going to be taking those suggestions. And you know, we really appreciate you guys watching. But what were they going to say? Fuck, bye. I forgot. No, not bye. There's something more about Frenny's. <laughs> Cody was trying very desperately to end it. He said, uh, I just, "Bye." He said, "God, I just want to end it." But 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 bye. Fuck, you got me distracted, bro. It was something about Frank. Oh, yeah. I, dude, I don't know how much money we have to pay or what we have to do, but I would love to get a neon sign of our logo in the game. Oh, of the CP squared logo? Dude, you I know how do- fucking cool that would be? I don't know how to... Co- well, I wish we knew how to contact them more directly. I know. Maybe Twitter DMs? I feel like we've given them enough free advertisement. I'm sure we could negotiate we've something. We've given them a lot of advertisement. <laughs> Twitter DMs. Twitter maybe. DMs, maybe. Yeah. Or... or- or, uh, don't, they don't have a contact me page on the Patreon? I don't know. Haven't looked. We should check. But through Patreon, you can send a message because uh, that's how you get your name in the game. Since we pay for King of Sex, which is, <laughs> which is the Patreon thing. I, is it King of Sex? I don't know. There's one above it that is something that's 50 bucks a month, mm-hmm. which is like you get you get like super head decisions. You fucking – there's like maybe 10 people in there. Those were sold out. Yeah, sold out. We would have bought it. I can imagine. But we we bought the $20 one that gets, like, a name and a phrase in the game. What's our phrase? Don't know. That's what we have to figure out. Are they Wait, funny what if phrase? it's just that quote? It's like, what's our phrase? I don't know. <laughs> I was just going to say, post a link to the YouTube <laughs> It would be funny. It's just very funny. But it's just something. So we have to think of that. And then YouTube maybe, at maybe when we send them a message, we could be like, look, we really like the game. What do we have to do for to our get... phrase? It should be IDK dot 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 subscribe to the CP2 podcast. That's fair. That's a lot. Is it? Some I people know. have like essays. Yeah. Some people. Have oh really? Paragraphs. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I have no idea. I haven't played the game. Yeah. So I. I'm, I, mean, I don't like, watch our content. We got. Yeah. We know. I'm good with IDK dot dot dot. I don't know. Subscribe to the podcast. Yeah. Uh, it's true. <laughs> Subscribe. All right. Well, I guess we fucking figured it out. Yeah. Uh, IDK. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's harder than I thought. Hmm. Fuck man. Yeah. Anyways, thanks everybody for watching. Yeah, sorry this was kind of rambly. Uh, that was just something we wanted to talk about, and there's some people who watch this who also watch the video. So yeah, we've it. been here for a while. We've been in the same clothes every day for these past. Yeah, weeks. it's been. We've been here for three weeks. <sighs> okay, bye, bye. bye.